My final last is Miss Fina D coming to you all from Fina Entertainment News. What's up, Team Twirl? Hi, everybody. Uh, please, please, please continue to lift our girl Kenya Moore and Baby Daily, her entire family, in your prayers. Kenya hopped on Instagram earlier and she posted test confirmed. I do have pre clam for short. Today, I will have to deliver Baby Daily early, but I'm being closely monitored to determine when to determine when thank you for all your love and well wishes okay that's power in numbers come on my prayer warriors go ahead and keep her lifted in prayer kenya will be fine even though you know you hear people on uh, their stories are okay and then the stories are not okay let's just go ahead and continue to pray this is something that she wanted for a very very long time and i'm praying that everything goes well and the next post like i said will be here guys baby daily is here i'm fine and baby daily is healthy the biggest joke are everybody saying kenya need to hold off and have this baby on november 4th when the show premiere oh my god y'all are too funny it's it's crazy that people will find a way to e ease their mind and provide positive la positive laughter but these are the comments right here of people saying yes kenya november 4th team petty i'm like you know what i don't care when as long as you know she's okay and the baby is fine but i just said that was funny and i had to include it in a video of people saying have that baby on the same night of the premiere and you get all the attention away people will still watch the show anyways but you already know who's gonna be all over the blogs but yeah we shall see if that's gonna happen but that's what people are saying kenya is gonna do i don't think kenya really cares but we will see <laughs> yeah too Whew, okay <laughs> you know like i always like i said in the last video that's a nervous laugh by the way when you support someone and you just uplift someone and you just want the best for them you know they become almost like it's almost like it's, it's my family you know because i'm all about uplifting everyone you know that's just who i am you know always positive over here so i'm lifting her you know in my presence i'm gonna have said that over and over again for those of you who missed the last few videos kenya been complaining for a little bit now about you know her hand she posted this right here all of that she posted first it was her hand then she posted about her feet after the baby shower in this image right here then you know she got up and posted this beautiful image talking about you know what happened uh, to her feet after Cynthia Bailey event. Great to celebrate Cynthia's latest accomplishment rain feet swollen and just go ahead and read the rest so she posted about that you know makeup still popping still smiling and then the next post after that was basically her showing her swollen feet she gained 17 pounds in one week and it was like oh whoa you know so she went ahead and went to the doctor and then that's when they find out that she had pre -clam. so uh and i i always say that for short because that's you know what they say for short and she posted at this image right here with her swollen feet and you know the caption i've read this but i'll go ahead and repeat myself for those of you who did not um see that video i made fun of my swollen feet at cynthia uh, party next day my test came back for possible there you go i gained 17 pounds in one week due to a severe swelling and water retention high blood pressure and excess protein in urine this is not normal i took more tests baby is fine but if they come back higher baby daily will have to come same day and there you go it looks like it got higher so baby daily will be here any day now yes i had to play on words <laughs> any day now but you know i'm relaxed i'm calm because she will be fine in the name of jesus and she's covered with the blood of jesus family you know i did read a lot of the comments in the last video when kenya made this announcement but for those of you who did not watch that video go back and watch it but you know a lot of people man uh some of the comments that i missed was just 
telling her that it will be okay. You have Selena Johnson. These are new comments that came in after I posted that video. No worries. God is with you. You will be fine. I had the same thing and feet and ankles look like this. They took my first baby early, but he, but he is fine and healthy and healthier than ever. It will be all good either way. Kenya responded. Thank goodness. Elena Johnson, an amazing singer. Ooh, love of words. And she's also on Sister Circle with Trina Braxton and Quad for Married to Medicine, okay? And then you also have, uh, let's see here. Basically, this person is trying to advise, you know, Kenya to her doctor need a refresher course it sounds like a doctors need a refresher course uh 17 pounds gain in one week plus protein in your urine hopefully they have you going to non-stress test and that's when kenya said you know she responded yes i'm doing all this just happened friday at my last visit and she did do the stress test this is the video right here so i'm doing this stress test for the baby i feel like crap <laughs> But if you listen, you can hear the baby's heartbeat on the monitor and they have me hooked up too. That I posted, there you go, with her um, basically doing the test and everything. So go ahead and watch that video. So everything that, you know, Team Twirl have been saying to her, she's been doing, you know, because this is important. And then Cynthia Billy also, you know, went ahead just to calm Kenya down a little you know same thing happened to me when I was pregnant you know and Noelle we all know Noelle she's an amazing young lady so Kenya you will be just fine Shamia you know offer her prayer Toya was on there as well for married medicine uh, many prayers and blessings you'll be fine now Egypt I didn't see Egypt comment when I um did the first video you know Egypt She's on HGTV. She used to be on V103 for a while out here in Atlanta, a radio host, and just a host of a lot of other things. Uh, she made a comment. This happened to me with my first pregnancy as well. Keep your feet elevated. Don't eat any salt. Wear compression socks. Drink tons of water. And don't worry about the weight. I gained over 80 pounds. Wow. With Kendo and lost it all in less than six weeks most of it was water weight you are almost there take care of yourself well there was another lady in here who talked about how she basically lost 64 pounds in 24 hours i was like whoa yeah yeah this comment right here i had the same during my pregnancy i walked in and was immediately admitted my eyes were even swollen shut we kept baby in for as long as possible but didn't go full term it was a rough delivery but all was well i lost 60 pounds in 24 hours just from releasing all the water i was retaining it was so scary to see my body change like that today we're both happy and healthy positive vibes and wishing safe delivery so there you have it you know people just letting Kenya know hey man I was there it happened to me fine I'm also going to go ahead and read the comments you know of people sending prayers and well wishes um, pregnancy is no joke prayers you know prayers for a safe delivery prayers to her I'm sure she will be fine her baby will be beautiful you know why can't people just say I'm praying for you even though I can't stand her, I'll pray. Like, what type of prayer is that? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what the heck? Then just don't make a comment at all. Like, exactly. People over here laughing at him. You know, if I was her, I wouldn't want your prayer. You cannot dislike a person and, <laughs> and your prayers be righteous, be a righteous prayer. But anything for a like, I guess. Right. Was that even necessary though? Just say prayer exactly. Like people are crazy. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but all prayers and well wishes exactly. You know, this person, <laughs> when was she do? I pray she will have a successful labor and baby will be all right. Praying. Anyone saying anything negative on here has never been pregnant. It is the scariest experience. Pray for her. Kenya, you got this. God didn't bring you this far to let you down. Amen. Amen. 
everyone who watches real housewife of atlanta knows how bad she wanted a child prayers up man yep we know praying for you queen and a baby you will have a safe delivery in the name of god just pray before you go do it because that's the same thing happened to me i had mine the same because baby heart was going down but god knows everything he will not let his children down just have faith and believe in him amen as you can see everybody over here praying for her kenya thank you for updating us supporters and you will be just fine you know there's power in numbers and matthew 18 19 Again, truly, I tell you that if two of you on earth agree about anything they ask for, it will be done for them by my Father in heaven. I, amen. So join me and let's all agree and, you know, in prayers and lift Kenya more and baby Dilly. And like I said, everything will be just fine no weapon form against you shall prosper kenya amen all right guys i'm going to go ahead and end it here my friend i love i just wanted to give you all a quick update and yes the video could have been over in the first two minutes but and people can go back and watch old videos but i just want to give a recap of everything that's happened so far leading up to this i'm wishing you all an amazing day i'm also wishing kenya an amazing day even though the situation might not feel amazing to her right now everything will be great okay and remember in this moment kenya to always have the god bless attitude which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation. Have a great day, guys. Be safe out there. If you're going for Halloween, all of that. Kenya, be safe and God bless. Bye-bye.